<gasps> what the f- I just sound like a little kid. What the hell? Is somebody up there? Hello? Oh my god. Oh my god. Someone's coming down. Why don't I see anybody? Hello? Oh, oh shoot, oh my god! I'm hearing all kinds of noises. There's people upstairs. There's like a demon growl or something. Guys, I don't really feel good right now. Children want to speak. It just said children want to speak. What? Hands tied. Hands tied? Oh, I'm getting freaking cold chills. And I don't see nobody. I'm in the shadows. In the twisted depths of trailing terror, a relentless stalker lures me deeper into the unknown. If you haven't witnessed the hair raising journey so far, make sure to catch up on the last five videos. The playlist is linked in the description below and pinned comment. Your support means the world to me. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and comment as we plunge headfirst into yet another bone-chilling expedition. All right, guys, things are getting a little unsettling right now. I do not know exactly what the heck to do in this situation, but I am starting to really get freaked out. I was at the gym, like always. I go to the gym five days a week. I'm working out, and I come out to my car after my lift, and... Um, there's some creepy stuff on the front windshield of my car. I looked at it and put it back because I wanted to document this. And things might sound a little weird right now. The picture might look a little unnormal compared to what you're used to because I have to use my phone because I don't have my camera set up on me. This was totally unexpected. Somebody knows that I go to this gym. Somebody's starting to realize my routine and now they're leaving stuff on my front windshield. Look at this, guys. <sighs> We're going to see what this is. I already looked at it, but for documentation purposes, I put it back just the way I found it. I am all sweaty. I'm trying to go home. And now this shit's happening. There's coordinates left on my front windshield right now. Guys, things are getting a little creepy. A lot creepy at this point. This is really, really, really concerning me. This was left on the front windshield of my car. My regular day routine. It says always, I think those are eyes, you. I'm thinking that means always see you. We have another stalker coordinate situation going on right here, and I don't know what to do. There's coordinates, always see you, and it's wrote on a napkin. And here's another one with different coordinates on it. It says, meet if you dare. And there's more coordinates on here. Guys, <laughs> what the f is going on? We're gonna look these coordinates up, I guess, and I need to get back home and do some research. This is gonna be the beginning of the video. We're gonna figure out these coordinates. I need to let Tina know about this. This is nuts. It's kind of concerning now and it makes me want to up the security in my house. I want you guys to look these coordinates up, both of them. Please, please, please do your research. Look the coordinates up. Let me know down in the comments where this place is, where both of these places is, if they have to do with anything at all that's going on with this whole freaking series about the stalker leaving coordinates. This is becoming very terrifying. This first one right here says always, it's either see you or booby you, if you look really close. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure it's see you. And the coordinates are 42.731663.
negative eight seven point eight one nine four nine five look that up let me know down in the comments where this place is and what it is and your thoughts on it as for this next set of coordinates i can't just not only just one set of coordinates i get two set of coordinates go me i appreciate it and i know you're watching this the second one is meet if you dare oh you already know that i'm not afraid to meet anybody and i'm not afraid to go anywhere so this is going to happen so bring it on the coordinates are 42.706809 negative 87.850409 Guys, look that up and tell me what you think I should do. If you guys are new to the channel or have not been following along with what's been going on during this whole series, I'm going to be pinning the playlist down below. The playlist is called Trailing Terror. It's about a stalker or somebody or an unknown person or an unknown entity leaving GPS coordinates for us to follow. And a lot of them are screwed up messed up locations scary locations abandoned locations haunted locations just crazy things are going on all the time and uh go down check that playlist out it's gonna be pinned in the comments below get caught up welcome to the channel <laughs> if you're if you're new and uh you guys that are following along the whole time thank you for the love and support it really means a lot to me and this channel would not be possible with without you Thank you so much. It could be one of you guys leaving, leaving the coordinates. So I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing, but we are gonna do our research on this and get going. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another scary adventure. Right now, I'm in the YouTube studio. It has been a couple weeks since that last clip. Now that last clip, I was actually working out in the gym and I came out and somebody had left coordinates on my windshield to two different locations. I've done a little research on one of these locations and we are going to go there tonight. One of the locations I have been there in the past a couple different times ironically. Um, the only difference with tonight is I'm going to be going solo. I'm going to be doing this alone and it's going to be terrifying. <laughs> so bear with me. I am starving and I have to head to the store. I'm gonna go get some sushi for dinner, and then let's get to the Scary Explorer. See you guys out there. I gotta eat this sushi. Look at this. You guys like sushi? Let me know down in the comments. If you don't like sushi, comment the puke emoji. I'm gonna eat this. Give me a little fit soda. Black cherry cola. I've never had one of these. It has zero calories, so that literally translates to taste like shit. <laughs> you know what? It's not that bad. We don't have time to waste. We gotta get to this spot. See you guys out there. I'm freaking nervous because if you've been following along, I know it's been a little while since a video has been uploaded, but if you've been following along with the last series, um, somebody's been leaving coordinates everywhere at each one of these locations for us to follow. And every time I go to the locations, there is something, it's either a really screwed up abandoned building with like satanic ritual circles, or just, we always find something insane at these locations. This is the first time I've done this alone since we've had the Stalker's Coordinate series, so... <sighs> Let's do this. There's no way someone's not going to see me going in this place. <laughs> but you know what? It's okay. Risk it for the biscuit. There's a reason why coordinates are leading to this. And I've been curious for weeks. Everything's just been really busy. Things have just been crazy in my life lately, and uh, I'm getting back to making content for you guys. It's what I love. It's what you guys love. So, here we are. Man. Hello? 
Hello? I feel like there's a lot more stuff in here a long time ago when we were in here. Guys, keep your eyes peeled for anything at all. Anything. <clears throat> if you see or hear anything that I miss, let me know down in the comments. <sighs> Hello? I'm not the cops, I'm just exploring. If somebody's in here, please let me know. I don't want to get spooked. I am armed and fully loaded. I'm literally just doing this for a documentary. So if somebody is in here, please, please let me know. Oh, that's getting all tore up. Hello? Dang, this place is getting real messed up. Hello? Is anybody in here? If somebody's in here, let me know. Whew, got a really bad feeling, man. Dang, this place is just completely deteriorating. It was nothing like this when I was here like last year. Holy crap. Why is there duct tape right there? Is anybody in there? All right. I'm assuming somebody is in there. So I'm just, I'm here in peace. Yeah, that door is locked. <clears throat> if you, if somebody is in here and you want me to leave you alone, can you please tap on the, tap on the wall or something and I'll leave? Seriously, just let me know. I'm a good guy. That door is locked for a reason. Hmm. Maybe there's a key somewhere. Just walking past. So far, I'm not seeing anything. Do you remember this area? Hello? Remember that handprint up there? Oh yeah, I remember that. It's still there. Oh, look at that. Oh my God, guys. Holy crap, look at it. It says for Jeremy. Okay, okay. <sighs> Hello? Oh my God. Ah. Look at this. Poor Jeremy, communicate with the dead to find answers. Use this house. What? What? 
What? <sighs> okay. Okay. <sighs> Sorry guys, I'm acting super paranoid right now. <sighs> Just found this note coming up the stairs. And it says, for Jeremy, communicate with the dead to find answers. Use this house. It has an upside down pentagram on it. Oh my God, I keep hearing noises down below me. That door is locked. Somebody is in that freaking room. And here I am alone. Guys, what does this mean? Am I supposed to like do a spirit box session or something here? I'm a little nervous. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little freaking nervous. This is nerve wracking. Doing this solo is crazy. I got an idea. I got an idea. There's this new paranormal app that, uh, it's not Paralysis. It's something else. What the heck's the name of it? Oh my God. I've been wanting to test out this new paranormal app for a while. It's a spirit box communication app. That's what we're gonna use. If you think that's what we're supposed to do, let me know down in the comments. But it sounds like we're supposed to communicate somehow with the spirits of this house. And I'm alone. And it's getting dark. What better way to do it than right now, right? Why not do it right here? The note was literally right here. I'm going to turn this around. It's enough of my face. I know you guys love my face, <laughs> but I'm, I was being blinded and see if there's anything else. I know there's, let's go look at this. How sound is this? I don't know how sturdy this is, honestly, but it looks to me, whoa, Whew. I smell a skunk. Somebody broke this window. Oh, spider webs. Oh, to get out on the roof. But you know what? We're not gonna go out on the roof. We're gonna get spotted. I think I'm gonna bust out this app and I'm gonna try it out right here. What do you guys think? Let's see what this app has to say. It's called Spirit Talker. Look at this. And this app idea actually came from a fellow YouTuber. Um, Omar Gosh. Was it Omar Gosh? I want to say it was Omar Gosh. So we are going to turn this on and see if we get any kind of communication come through. And we're going to do it like right here. I mean, that's where that note was left. That's obviously the reason why we were led here so let's do it i'm gonna turn it on turn it up all the way and uh let's ask him questions uh, three. Oh my god it just said three i was literally just thinking if there is any spirits in this house that want to communicate so there's three of you in here what is your purpose? Dude. What about, dude? What about dude? What is your name? Can you tell me your name? So, so far it said three and dude. I just heard something shuffle outside down below me. Maybe it's not a good idea to be up here. Is there somebody in this house that wants to harm me? Encounter. Encounter. Are you saying that I'm going to encounter somebody? I hear thumping. The woods. The woods? What about the woods?
What can you tell me about the woods? I'm shaking a little bit, guys. Whoa. Terrible. The woods are terrible? Did something happen to you in the woods? Gertrude. Gertrude? Is that a name? Gertrude. What is Gertrude? Guys, do you know what Gertrude is? Is there a message that you want to tell me? Do you need to tell me something? If so, please tell me now. Maybe we should try a different spot. We're friends. We're friends? Okay. Have I ever met you before? I'm gonna head down. Guys, are you still with me? Let me know. Let me know down in the comments. Whew. This place is just a whole nother vibe when you're alone. I don't really want to go down to that basement. Whew. Those stairs at the bottom don't even look safe. So far, that's the only thing I've seen here. Was that note? And honestly. Us. Us? Okay. So there's three of you here. Is there any? King? Who's the king? It just said three and king. If there's three of you here, who is the king? Do you want to communicate with me? Or do you want to tell me something? Please, please let me know. Sixteen. Sixteen. Guys, what does this mean? Sixteen? Is that how old you were when you passed away? Alice. Alice. Was Alice your name? Why did those coordinates lead me to this house? Can you tell me? Maybe let's go back here, kind of look around. See if there's any signs of Alice. Oh, what is this? I seriously thought that, that was a rolled up $100 bill. <laughs> is there anybody buried on this property anywhere? Haunt? Okay. You haunt this property. How did you pass away? Well, there's something dead in there. Emergency. Emergency? You passed away in the emergency room? Did you have an accident of some sort? Guys, this is just a, this is a little interesting. I'm not gonna lie. The Spirit Talker 
app is I don't know how legit it is, but I mean, from what I've heard, it's a pretty good app and it's very reliable. Bones. Bones. Are there bones of you on this property somewhere buried? Guys, it just said bones. Where are your bones? <sighs> My heart's racing a little bit. Can you tell me where your bones are? Can you lead me to your bones? Guys, let me know down in the comments your opinion. Implies. Implies. What does that mean? Lead me to your bones on this property. What are you getting out of this so far? Because it's making a little bit of sense to me, but I mean, without your guys' help, Sorry. It sounds like there's footsteps in the woods. It's the middle of the freaking daytime, and I don't see nobody. I'm in the shadows. You're in the shadows? That's what I do. Keep exploring, stay in the shadows. I'm in the shadows. Are you in the basement? Oh my god. Are your bones buried in the basement of this house? Jordan. Jordan. Who's Jordan? I have to set this app down. Or I have to set this phone down. Whew. Switch my arm. So I got Alice and Jordan in the shadows. Bones are buried in the shadows. What does this mean? Why was I led here to this house? I have to do some more research on this place. Should I go down into the basement? Jordan or Alice? Can we get a third yes. dress? Do I have to dress a certain way? Children want to speak. It just said children want to speak. What? Hands tied. Hands tied? Oh, I'm getting freaking cold chills. Hands tied? Children want to speak? It sounds like something really bad happened in this house. Did something bad happen here? Were there children with their hands tied? In the shadows? Guys, what are you getting from this? Let me know down in the comments. I'm, I'm stumped, I'm lost. At the same time, freaking terrified. Even though it's in the middle of the daytime, being in this house, right now with that door locked knowing somebody is in there most likely is terrifying to me this is freaking terrifying please hit the thumbs up button i make noises you make noises can i hear you can you do something to let me know that you're here guys if you have any clue or idea about what's going on, why the coordinates led me here, why it told me to communicate with the dead. Like, what does that note have to do with anything? Maybe we should try Necrophonic. Do you guys want me to try Necrophonic? Let me know down in the comments. I died. You died? Okay, I understand that. Is there anything at all that I can do to help you? to help you cross over or to help you in any way. I'm your friend and I'm here, I'm here for you. Maybe we should try Necrophonic. I'm gonna go now, okay? Stacy. Stacy. Okay, we got Stacy. So I'm gonna turn this off 
and I am going to load up Necrophonics. It's been a while since I used this app. sound man every time here we go you can talk in this app now is there anybody here that wants to communicate here yes us run two. two guys if you hear something come through that I don't let me know down in the comments nurse there's nothing they give me cold chills. Is there anybody here that wishes to communicate with me? You can com communicate through this device. What is your name? Tell me your name. Vehicle losing. I don't know. That's what I heard. Is there anything I can help you with? There's a lot coming through right now. Is there anything that you need me to do? while I'm here. Anything at all? I heard get in my bed or something like that. Can you tell me your can you tell me your name? Can you tell me how you died here? How many of you are here? I heard just 11. Oh my God, somebody's walking upstairs. Oh my God. Hello? Hello? I hear you up there. I know someone's up there. Hello? <gasps> what the f- They just sound like a little kid. What the hell? Is somebody up there? Hello? Oh my god. Oh, f someone's coming down. Why don't I see anybody? Hello?
Oh, 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 shoot. oh my god! I'm hearing all kinds of noises. There's people upstairs. There's like little kids upstairs too. And that was a f demon growl or a something. Guys, I don't really feel good right now. And considering what happened to me at Eidenberg Manor, this is a little freaky. I don't know if those were people or not upstairs. I don't know how they got up there. Okay, okay, this is crazy. That was terrifying. Guys, what do you guys think about this? Let me know down in the comments. My heart is going a thousand miles per hour right now. Hello? There's the window to the upstairs. It's right there. That's the window I was looking out of. And that's where the noises were coming from. <sighs> Guys, let me know down in the comments what you guys think of this, everything that happened tonight. I need you more than ever, more than I have ever needed you on the channel. I need your guys' help now more than I ever have. There's just so much stuff going on right now in my life and so much just craziness in general going on with the channel and everything. This, the coordinates, why am I here? My personal life is freaking screwed up. I need you guys right now more than ever. I really do. Please help me out. Please let me know what you guys think of this video, what you think of all this, the coordinates, what was said on the spirit box. Add it up. Let me know down in the comments, please. Um, I'm a little terrified. I'm not going to lie. I never get scared either. Um, those were some pretty loud noises in the house. So, yeah, let me know. I love you guys so much. Appreciate the support means everything to me. Until next time, guys, keep exploring, stay in the shadows.